Okay. Game face on. We're we're gonna we're gonna res up Jody today. Hi, welcome in. My name is Messenger, and either welcome back or welcome to my channel and this particular playthrough of Stardew Valley, where I'm romancing every single lady of Stardew Valley. <laughs> The mod that I'm playing adds some spicy scenes, so beware of that. Although I think we're a little bit further off from all of that because I need to get my friendships up with the people first. And as per request, we're going to go for Jody and the Witch first. So those are our two um, future partners, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna let you know a little bit more about the challenge, but uh, first of all, let's get back into the game, shall we? Good morning, it's a rainy day. We're back, so we don't have need to water anything. How's my luck looking? Oh, we have a little pyramid. Nice. We like that. Let's go. Okay. Right. So... Um, I wanted to let you know about some more things I'm going to do when it comes to this particular playthrough uh, while I harvest some of my crops here and try to get back into the game. <laughs> um, I think, let me, let me check, let me double check so I'm not gonna give the wrong name. Joel um, suggested me to be adding the binning skill so I've added that to the game, which is a mod that basically makes going through bins a skill. And it's really interesting. And I'm really excited to see if, if it works or not. <laughs> I really hope it does. I've added it. Um, yeah, we're just gonna see um, if it breaks my, my save or not. Don't worry, I have I have a backup save, so we're, we're gonna be fine either way. Um, but yeah, just just letting you know, um, um, I do do have that. If I do I have anything that Olivia loves, I probably don't, because she has very expensive taste. It's her birthday today, so I do want to give her a love gift, if that's at all possible. If not, she's just going to get a liked gift. And this one is a starred potato, so that might be good, but yeah. I would prefer to give her something she loves. She thinks she loves frozen cheese. Probably not, no. I could get this broken open, see if there's anything valuable inside. You know what? We might as well get. Listen, Claire's here. I want to gift her something. I just saw. Oh my god, I didn't even realize it's, it's salmon berry season likes this well okay nobody loves them that's so sad i think i would love them let me know what would be a, like your love gift in stadio would do you think you would be easy to gift to or would you be someone that like only loves prismatic shards uh let me know i think i would be fairly easy to give to <laughs> So I'm really wondering if the binning skill actually was added or not, since this is a save that already existed. So I'm not, I'm not quite certain that it worked, um, but I'm sure I'll find out. Wait, couldn't I just find out here? <gasps> yes, it did. Let's go. I wonder now. I want to. I'm, I'm wondering. Should I add more skills to the game? What do you guys think? I'm excited to see if the binning skill works. Okay, where is Olivia hiding? Oh, she's meditating in her room. Well, um, is she gonna come out at any point or... Wait, am I... Do I have two hearts with her? No. <laughs> oh, how hard... Okay, well, Haley is up there. Oh, okay. I'm sure she's gonna be like two hearts by the end. Because after I've given her a like, oh, is she gonna come out or is she gonna... She's painting. Wait, what's her schedule? 
it looks as if she's gonna come out later today to drink in the wine cellar so we're just gonna catch her then and go mining instead I really have to upgrade my pickaxe and my sword because this is ridiculous. <laughs> We now have a gift for the witch. Oh no, it's already so late. I've got to go run. Otherwise, Olivia's house is going to be locked. <gasps> Let me out. <laughs> oh. Oh no. <gasps> that, oh my gosh, okay, we just made it. All right, well, I guess we're just gonna hand her a potato, so. Any of, I wonder if any of Victor's friends want a part-time job cleaning the house. It saved me a lot of time. Do you think she wants to see me in a maid outfit? Because I will. I will clean her house and put that on. No problem. No questions asked. No problem. Okay, let's go donate to the community center and I think I Well, I'm gonna try to run around and hunt for some forage, but I think after that I'm just gonna call it a day It's my I mean it's already like 9 10 so Not much time left Does the witch have a closing time for her tower? Or can I just show up there at 11 p.m.? Oh, it's literally 11 p.m. All right then, fair enough, you know? I also wouldn't have guests show up at my doorstep past 11 a.m. p.m. A.m. p.m., definitely p.m. Don't show up before 11 a.m. either. <laughs> unless, unless specified, but no. Blue flower, its blossom blings, brings false prophets, but where to place it? Its many shades have no meaning. A flower unloved but well liked has no true purpose. It sings the blues indeed. Embrace the mysteries of the day, messenger. Huh. <laughs> She's talking about blue jazz and how. Wait, does nobody love it? What? Wait, does. Wait, I'm gonna have to check that later. Nobody loves blue jazz. <laughs> That's a bit sad. <laughs> okay, I think while I go on a little foraging trip around Cindersep Forest, this is a perfect time to talk about what my goals are for this playthrough. I've discussed this in the comments of the last video a little bit with some of you guys. Thank you again so much on the love of that video. That was so nice. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this series as much as I am, or at least appear to be enjoying it as much as I am. So thank you, thank you so much for all the love on that. Um, I think what 
I want to challenge myself for it to do this time is um, not necessarily perfection since I do not I know this would take like a long time but uh, maybe down the line maybe I'll change my mind and down the line I want to go for perfection but what I've now settled on is a poly percent uh, poly any percent run poly any percent run so we're gonna we're gonna have lots and lots of wives down the line fingers crossed that works and um, what I also want to challenge myself to is getting all the straw star drops in a as fast uh, way as possible and also because I th think um, since I have so many wives that means I, I have to have game right so what other perfect way to see if I have game than for me to challenge myself to complete both <laughs> I'm gonna hate myself for this, I think, down the line, I'm gonna regret it, but I'm still gonna say it. I want to challenge myself to complete both Journey of the Prairie King and Juno Card. <laughs> and I've never, I think I, I've gotten close to getting Journey of the Prairie King. I think I will do it on my perfection farm, that's uh, my live stream. Um, but I've never, e like I think I've beaten the first level of Juno Card. Um, so that's as much as I know about that game and I'm really bad at it, but because I mean I need game I need game to get all these ladies, so uh, It just makes sense that I have to be good at the games, right? So um, I'm gonna challenge myself to do that during these runs should anything else come up that I really want to challenge myself to do I'll let you go. I'll, I'll keep you guys updated but Yeah, that's that's my current <gasps> oh my gosh Whoa! I think this is so much better than my current sword. Wait, I don't even have it on me, but oh my gosh, and I got two- Oh my god, there's another ancient sword down here? Did I never know about this place? Or has this just spawned here? Has this always been a thing? I've only just known this as a spot for forage. <laughs> oh, well that's awesome. Okay, alright, let's go. Um... What was it? Another? Okay, there's... Was this... Was there a battle here? What happened? Who won? Um, it's like just four ancient swords just randomly sitting in the forest. What? What is this? <laughs> what is this place? Okay, well... Um, yeah, so as I was saying, those are my, my goals currently for this run. And should anything else come up that I want to add to the challenges, or maybe you have amazing challenges, uh, please, please let me know um, in, in the comments below. So uh, I would love to, to try new things this time around. And um, I think you guys have amazing ideas since you've seen lots of different playthroughs of Stardew already, most of you at least. So yeah, please, please let me know. Any notices me but chooses not to say anything. Okay, well, a bit rude but understandable. <laughs> Thirty copper ores. Um, I think we're gonna accept this one because. That one is fairly easy to get and we need the copper anyway, so it is a quest from Clint, who I famously despise, but I think it's worth it for the copper and the reward, of course, so let's just take it. I'm not in a good mood right now. It's, it's, I said I'm not in a good, good mood. What do you want? Oh. I'm sorry, Abigail. <laughs> Do you want a rock to munch on to make you feel better, maybe? Well... I think I'm gonna sell the gold star, um, spring onion and leek. And... Oh, I need both of these for the community center. Oh, whoops. 
And let me just check. So the steel sword is 48 damage. Oh, this is so much better. Okay. Which means um, next time we go to the mines, I'm going to sell um, da -da 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 -da, the steel sword. Uh, I might just sell three of the ancient swords. I don't think I need it for anything. Maybe I'll just keep one for like nostalgia. I don't know. I'm uh, gonna keep the fiber. Perfect. Wait, did I need any of this? No, I don't think so. Okay. Right. So I guess we're gonna do some donations soon. Sell two. Uh, okay. I might just do a little... Oh, wait. I haven't foraged here. Okay, that's actually really good that I came across here. Because we needed another daffodil. Perfect. Oh, let's go. Okay, we can finally craft sprinklers and mayo machines. Oh, I thought I was gonna get a foraging level up, but no, apparently not. <laughs> we did make some good money though, so I'm happy about that. Oh, is this the first time I'm actually entering the guild? Whoops. You ventured into the mines with utmost courage. We would, we could use someone with your skills. Do you want to join? Of course. Of course I want to join the guild. What do you mean? Messenger, do you swear under oath to protect humanity from monsters and to do everything in your power to uphold the traditions, values and ideology of the Adventurers Guild? If that ideology means... Uh, marrying every single lady of Stardew Valley, then yes. On behalf of Stardew Valley and the Order of the Knights of Pythagoras. <laughs> Why Pythagoras? He was a mathematician. Like, a, a squared plus B squared equals C squared. Like, what? I officially accept you as the 23rd Adventurous Guild member. 23rd? As a member of the Adventurous Guild, you will be allowed to purchase rare weapons, be commissioned, and discover. There are also bounties and quests you can access from the notice board behind me. Okay. Welcome to the guild! I, I expect great things from you. Yes, I, I'm going to be great. Don't you worry. Okay, well, let me sell this sword first. <laughs> and let's go. I also realized I picked up the freaking painting from the museum, but... I guess it's in my inventory now, so we're just, we're just, we're just gonna live with that. Wait, can I actually, can I put the painting here? Oh, that would have been so cool. All right, unfortunate. I have so many ladders. Wait, is today the last day for the quest? Oops. Oh no, I gotta go talk to Clint. Can I- where is he at this time? Can I even get to him? Um, I'll- I'll- just, I'll see if I can complete this, because this would be good for the cash and everything. Just gonna walk for... Like... Hours now. I hope he comes out on a Wednesday. I hope he goes to the pub, but I'm- I really have no idea. Oh my gosh, there he is. Just being creepy, but that's okay. At least I get the payment. Let's go. Very exciting, very exciting. Was I already here today? Did I check his trash can? I think I did. Yep. I could just go back mining. 
bread. Let's go. Oh, also, wait. I think it was sardines. Can I catch sardines at this time of day? Oh, wait. I don't even have a fishing rod with me. Forget what I said. Oh, wow. I'm actually kind of worried now because I don't even know yet what the bulletin board uh, requests are going to be and I've been selling all the salmon berry that I've been getting um, imagine if I get the um, foragers bundle <laughs> because I know this one is like a buttload of salmon berry or I think um, I don't know it was something else or I think it's either the berry you get in spring or the one you get in fall or I think a couple um, plums, wild plums, but yeah watch me get that bundle now that I've been just selling all of my salmon berry. <laughs> Ooh, we can hang up our picture. Nice, that's pretty cute. <laughs> Ooh, my binning is leveled up. Amazing, let's go. I'm really excited to see how, how this um, skill progresses. Because I've never played with it, so this is really fun. Oh no! The crow ate my rice! I forgot to put a scarecrow down here. Oh no! Ah, <laughs> oh, unfortunate. Alright, well... We don't have any rice shoots anymore now, which is fine, but... It's, it's a bit... It's a bit un upsetting. I could... Hmm. I am... I am definitely debating to get the uh, pickaxe upgrade because I am feeling very, very slow in the mind. So I think I'm actually going to go for that today. And I want to go... What am I doing? And I want to go gift the... Uh, wait, I could also go fishing afterwards. And I do want to go gift the witch something. So I think we're going to go this way then. And it's also Pam's birthday, so uh, does she like a green bean? I could just give that to her. Uh, she likes it. Yeah, you know what? I might just gift her the bean. That's okay. There she is. Wait, I've already... Oh, I've already given her two gifts. Oh, I guess I gave her a gift at the end of last episode and I forgot. The bound, brown trooper going beneath the earth, its powers locked away. One must know the right way to unlock its true potential. It has saved nations and yet crushed them. Such is its temperament. You're talking about potatoes? Seek the energy's messenger. Enjoy the day. Oh, thank you. How many hearts do I have with her? One. <laughs> okay. Okay, well. Ooh. At least we do have lots of um, solar essence now or we do get them on a regular basis so I can just keep giving that to her but yeah this is leveling up her friendship is taking a while and I don't think I'm gonna ha be there in time for the for the dance which I would have really liked to do but I don't I, I don't think there's enough time at all Yep, yeah, there she is. Here you go. Hey, now, this is a great present. You've made my year a little better. Thank you. My house ain't pretty, but at least it's by the river. That's true. There's some green goo on the couch. I would look into that. Looks a little bit radioactive, but maybe that's just me. Okay, well, I think we should go and try to catch some sardines. Wait, actually, oh my god, I almost forgot that I meant to ask Clint for a, a pickaxe upgrade. <laughs> okay. Let's actually do that first. OK, 
Okay, well, I am ready to catch some sardines here with Victor. Hi, Victor. I think I do see them in the water. I think I'm good. So let's do that for a bit and see if we get any. Get another quest done, you know. Gotta grind the, uh, the quest as well as the love. That makes sense at all? Probably not. I've also just realized we're more than halfway, oh, like about halfway through the week and I have not yet given Caroline, a uh, Caroline, hello? Well, also not Caroline, but I've not yet given Jody a gift. I think I wanted to see if I can find loft gifts for her before giving her just, well, like cauliflower or something. But I do have a gold star cauliflower, so I'm wondering if I just want to gift that to her. Hey, let's go. I'm done with this. Oh, can I still get in? Yes. Oh, right. We could get another... No, I, I was like, we could get another rod, but no. <clears throat> I can learn how to make a seaweed salad. Not really. Okay, well, I just wanted to talk to you. Thank you. Perfect. Slowly earning the money back. Um, that was, that we spent on the upgrade for the pig eggs. Okay, well, I was gonna say I was, I'm going to go over to Clint's to get these geos broken up open but it is already past four so I guess I won't be doing that hmm I can check so Jody what do I have hmm yeah I really I don't have anything in my possession right now that she loves which is really hard so oh no oh no I might just give her the golden cauliflower uh, since that's like a good quality gift um, I can see her she just walked into the house so I'm hoping I can still catch her when um, I'm back with the gift I don't think the house is gonna be closed by then so we should be good Let's go. So, hey, you go, Jody. <clears throat> she keeps telling me the same thing about me having to ask uh, Sophia and Andy for pointers. Like, what? What's she? What's she trying to tell me, huh? Oh, I've already checked all these bins. Okay. Well then. At least we're at two hearts now with Jody. Oh, we've given her two gifts too. So I guess we gave her a gift on Sunday as well. Yeah, I, I, I'm not keeping track of this. I should be, but I'm not. But I'll try to do better in the future. <laughs> I should also start leveling up my friendship with Caroline a lot faster so we can get those tasty, tasty sea sap tea saplings. Fisherman achievement. Oh, but the bubble bot, bubble bot, bubble bot. Hello, bubble spot disappeared, and I don't see any others around. So, well, might just keep fishing. Wait, is that the legend? Do you see this fish? Just. That's, that doesn't look like a largemouth bass. That looks like the legend, it's just swimming. <laughs> Big chillin'.
Oh, the spirits don't want to play nice with us today, but that's all right. <gasps> Miss our hats, come to old, old house, Pokey. Bring coinies. Hat mouse. And yes, oh my god, Jordy wants a cauliflower. I really hope this is gonna help with me getting friendship up. Friendship up? It, it should, I think. It, it really should. So I'm glad I kept that one cauliflower. I did keep that one cauliflower, right? So how is... Yes, I did. Oh my gosh, okay. Um, I already, I'm already, again, all over the place when it comes to uh, all of my chests, so that's great. Okay, so because I do not have my pickaxe yet, the plan is to... I think I'm just... Oh, oops. Um, I'm just too early. I think I want to um, give Jody the cauliflower and then I guess we're gonna give Caroline the potato because I, mm, I just really don't have any other gift for her at the moment and at least that one is like silver quality so it's better than just the daffodil for instance here. And she likes both of them. Um, so, you know, it's at least what I think to do in my brain. Oh, I should have gone past the traveling card first. Um, no, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do that later. It's traveling card day today. I've totally forgot. Okay. Did you wipe your boots off before coming in? Of course I did. I'm always welcome. Perfect. 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 Okay. Did that give- Yes, that absolutely gave me a boost. <gasps> I'm at three hearts now! Oh my gosh! That's exciting. Okay, Vincent, you're definitely in my way, but that's okay. I forgive you. And I think I'm just going to go and give that potato to Caroline. Yeah, I think- I think that's the plan. <laughs> at least for now. Of course, I'm sure. It's a fine looking day. On days like this, I like to help Evelyn in the public gardens. When it's raining? She's strong for age, but I think she appreciates all the help she can get. Okay. Wow, just realized it's Friday. Exciting. Oh my gosh. Wait, I've, I don't think I've ever read this. Okay. To Mr. Pierre, it pains me to be the bearer of bad news, but I feel obligated to inform you of a recent development most threatening to your livelihood. Joja Co. has decided to expand into Pelican Town. It's too late for protest. Joja builders have already broken ground for the new Joja Mart. This must be dev devastating news for you. So many years in business, dot dot dot, a local standby, dot dot dot, and now obscured by the shadow of a powerful, efficient, Economically viable corporation. What a shame. <laughs> Why does this sound like, like a letter I would write to someone in middle school? As manager of the new Jojo Mod, I feel to some degree personally responsible for your predicament. As such, I'd like to offer you a position as assistant grocer. Wages starts at 5G an hour? At 5G? I look forward to seeing your re resume. Mr. Moore's manager panic in town jojo mod i've never read this what okay so like 5g an hour right um i think just a single seed is like okay like like from pierre's it's like 20 g so you'd have to work for four hours at jojo mod as a grocer to be able to um to afford a single seed. Um, talk about minimum wage. Holy heck. Oh, I feel even worse for Claire and Martin now. Oh, can I? Oh, I forgot that I can't have him open. Oh, frick. I forgot that I can't have Clint open geodes when he's still working on my freaking pickaxe because I'm so used to playing on multiplayer on early levels. 
Hi, it's me, Editing Messenger. Thank you so much for all the love on the last video. I am so grateful for everyone subscribing to the channel and commenting so many lovely things. And with a little bit of luck, I might even be able to apply for a partner before the end of the year. That sounds so wild to say out loud. Thank you all for making that possible. Oh, and while I was talking, I'm just getting a couple fish and some artifacts in the game, so no romancing any sexy mermaids or anything like that. Uh, oh, that reminds me. Is there a mod to do that? Just asking for um, science reasons. Anyway, uh, let's just get back into the video. I think I'm gonna make this one my last fish because I still wanna go past the traveling merchant. I think she's there until 10. Oh, it's eight, isn't it? Frick. Okay. I can't even pet the pig. The pig is asleep. It's freaking. Does it tell me? I think it's actually eight o'clock. You know what? Good for her for setting boundaries on, like, how how late she's she's going to stay up. So, um, that's that's good for her, I I guess. Just not good for me. I guess I'm just gonna go fish and see if I can catch a bream in my own river here since I, I still need that I think for the night fishing bundle um, my, at least I would probably level up a fishing level so you know but uh, I am a bit miffed about missing the merchant today that's unfortunate we'll still see her on Sunday but still <laughs> There we go, we got a bream, perfect. I'll probably just keep fishing for the rest of the day. The night. It's 10.30, but you know. There we go, level up. I, f I can't believe I still haven't leveled up. Um. Oh nice, my pickaxe is there. I, I, I can't believe I still haven't um, leveled up in foraging. To be fair though, oh I might actually today. <clears throat> to be fair, um, oh thanks Jody. I, uh, oh, full, oops. I have, um, I don't know, I guess I can sell all of these. <clears throat> what was I saying? Um, probably something not profound, but that's okay. Right, I was going to say, to be fair, I am already higher level on foraging, so I guess it just takes longer to level up. That That's literally that all I, all I meant to say, and it did take me a while, but hey, you know what? We got there in the end. I didn't mean to do this. Oh gosh, here we go. No! No! Oh gosh, I don't think I can get... No! Ah, oh, I meant to go give Caroline a gift. I just missed her. No! Oh no. Okay, when is she done reading here? That is so... So unfortunate. Okay. Okay, she's gonna leave here at 12, so I'm hoping I can catch her then. It's so sad because the door is open, but of course I, ca I can't get in, so she she's just... St oh, <laughs> I wasn't watching where I was walking. She just won't let me in. Um, I guess we're just gonna go collect the pickaxe then and donate 
Oh, hi, Cola. And donate all um, what we can donate. Gimme, gimme. Yes. So excited for this. Okay, let's go and process some geodes, see if we get... Oh, another dwarf helmet. Wait, I can wear this, right? But it looks silly, so I'm not going to. <laughs> can I? Oh, never mind, I can't. Okay, well, I thought I could, but maybe I'm wrong. So, I guess I was wrong. Okay, let's go catch Caroline while she comes out of the room. When she stops reading, finally. Oh, do you think I can... Frick! I thought maybe... Oh, no, she saw me do it twice! Oh, no. <laughs> Oops. Okay, there she is. Okay, I'm just gonna wait until she comes over here. Yay, let's go. Okay, um... I'm on one heart with her. However, okay, never mind. I'm not that close, so... Uh, I was... I tried. <laughs> okay, let's go donate things to the center and then we can finally go mining because it is a max luck day, so that would be great. I'm all going to ignore Shane's birthday for now because uh, not really someone that I can get to know intimately in this playthrough, unfortunately. Oh, well, I guess I can sell this. <laughs> it's literally the same sort that I already got. Ooh, I think that's a magnet ring. Let's go. Okay, well, that's definitely better. <laughs> Ow. I do need to sell, uh, need to slay some of these dust sprites, so. Oh, I need to talk to the witch. Okay. At least that's really good. I think that's that's also going to help us get the relationship up with the witch. So I'm happy I did that. And I still have time. So I can go over there tomorrow when I go get the traveling cart. Or when I check out the traveling cart at least. Perfect. Definitely doing a lot better in terms of my goals of romancing everyone this time around than last time. I think I'm already doing better with the gifts. Um... It, let me know. What do you think? Ooh, let's go. My bidding level improved and my combat improved and my mining improved okay perfect let's go I didn't sell anything I forgot <laughs> we got our first strawberries oh wait my inventory is absolutely full I'm just going to spare you some very painful inventory management time, aka me staring at my chest for a couple minutes, so um, let's skip ahead to the next thing. Alright, let's go grab a present for the witch. There we go. And go down there. And say hi to the traveling merchant. Merchant for real this time. Maybe she sells something good that we need. That would be awesome. Oh, I'm tempted, but this is so expensive. Have I already gotten a rare seed? I don't think I do. Okay, I'm gonna go buy the rare seed. And uh, I don't know if the, is the coffee bean worth it? Hmm, I kind of think it would. Uh, I really like coffee in this game. I like coffee IRL, but I love coffee in this game because it just makes you go faster and you're not taking such a long time to do anything. Everything, I mean. Oh, <gasps> witch cutscene. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, messenger, I foresaw you're coming today. Please join me. <gasps> oh, I'm excited. 
How goes your quest with the Junimos? It's going great. Excellent. You have been chosen for an impo important task. <laughs> um, that was the Freudian slip. Nobody heard that. Do not falter. Okay. What are you gonna do now? Here, I have something for you. A lesson in the pervasive energies of the world. Come closer. I am coming closer. Do you see the symbol here? This is a gate, a portal to another world, a doorway through which an elemental can traverse, or a window through which I can peer. She watching me sleep. Uh, have you ever kind of? I don't think so. I am hardly surprised. <laughs> okay. Elementals are a sort of spirit composed of the most pure building blocks of our universe. They are rarely seen by the common human. They show them themselves only to the truly special. Some, like myself, are fortunate enough to seek and find them, eventually forming a bond of sorts. Okay. Those spirits that you have encountered in the town are not elementals. There is something more... Derivative, derivative and simplistic, though they, st though still intriguing, intriguing. Oh my gosh, I really cannot talk today. Nevertheless, I believe it is safe to say they have taken an interest in your fate, and whenever a spirit takes interest, interest, so must we all. Um, today is not a reading day for me. <laughs> oh, what does that mean? Perhaps someday he will attract greater attention. Until then, surf the world, messenger. Be at peace. Oh, she's so cute. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Um, all right. Well, I still want to give her the gift. Oh no, where is she? Oh, which? Oh, there she is in her bedroom. Okay, well, I'm, I'm sure I can just... Oh. The elementals are pleased with the job you did. Here's your payment as promised. Oh, oh, I also did the quest for her, right. Ah, this is imbued with potent arcane energies. It's very useful for my studies. Thank you. I do hope what I have said doesn't get to your head. Pride easily maneuvers you off the wise path. Maintaining a clear mind is crucial for the path ahead of you, farmer. Oh, she calls me farmer, okay. She had her little nickname. Oh my gosh. I'm getting my gold reward. Oh my god, I'm so... Ooh, I'm so close to being able to buy the coffee bean. I'm literally I'm missing five gold. <laughs> okay, well, I'm sure... Um, oh, no, well... Okay. What can we sell? Maybe I'll find some forge on the way that I can sell to Pierre. That would be perfect, but... Um, hmm. Oh, I can see if they have any spring onions, even though today is reset day for all forge, so it's gonna be pretty hard to find anything. But, um, we could just steal Andy's crops. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Yeah, no, no spring onions for us. That's unfortunate. Okay, well. Oh, I really want those coffee beans. Okay, I can do it, I can do it. I, I'm, I know I can do it. I just have to budget correctly. Oh wait, never mind. I completely forgot I was gonna sell some things to the guild. Um, I think I can do that. So... Herring. Sure, I think I actually have one lying around, so I should be able to do that. Um, can I sell... Oh no, never mind. Okay, well... Oh wait, is Caroline here? There she is, let's go. Okay, perfect. Wait, no, I was going to give this to Jody. Hello? My brain is all kinds of all over the place. <laughs> okay, let's actually go give this to Jody before I forget again. Oh gosh. Here you go. I'm taking a break from house chores today. If you don't spend any time outside, I'll go- if I don't spend any time outside, I'll go crazy. Plus, I don't want my legs to turn soft. You're literally washing dishes right now, but- but okay. All right. Um, don't know, don't know if I would call that a break. Oh, there's some, oh, there's so much forage here. Okay, let me pick this up. I'm still gonna go and grab the herring because I can give that to Vincent and get more gold. No, don't eat it, please. And then, okay, I have a whole path mapped out in my brain. I think I can get a lot of things today. Um, where am I at with the witch actually? 
I'm at one heart. Okay, one one hard earned heart. I think all those love gifts are paying off, which is really nice to see. And I'm at three hearts with Jody. Oh my gosh, let's go. Okay. Okay, well, I just realized that I did not keep any of the herrings, so I'm gonna have to fish for them. All right, we have enough for that coffee bean, which is great. Hi, Martin. And now we can sell some things at the Adventure Guild and then just circle back all the way down to the traveling merchant. And I think that might be one of the last things to do today because I don't think I can actually get back to the ocean to fish. I'm, I would at least, yeah, I don't know. Or rather, I don't know if I want to because that's like so far, <laughs> so far away. And I'm so slow <laughs> with my little short little legs, tiny, tiny. That's the most expensive coffee bean I've ever bought, but oh, I, I think it's worth it because I can't get it any other way right now. At least not as long as make me watch me get like a random monster drop tomorrow with coffee beans. <laughs> uh, but uh, you know what? At that point, I'll have forgotten. There we go, I've been waiting for this. I finally got the bee house. I can make some speed grow and farmer's lunch. And my foraging is leveling up, so we don't have to worry about summer seeds anymore. And I got a charcoal can recipe, which I don't know if I'm gonna use yet, probably not now, because I do need the wood. And we made almost, oh yeah, we made all the money back that we spent on the coffee bean. <laughs> so, um. That, I guess that's good at least so I'm not completely in the minus but yeah it's I think it's this is pretty fun and yeah this is where I'm gonna leave this episode for sure we got some sprinklers so that's really nice that's really helping um, as soon as some spots here are uh, open I'm gonna put more sprinklers down but for now that's all we have and in terms of relationship, we do have three hearts with Jody, so that is pretty, pretty phenomenal. We're almost at four, and then, uh, I'm, yeah, the witch. We're still at a single heart. I feel like it's really hard to level her friendship up right now, even though we keep giving her her love gifts. Doesn't doesn't feel as if I'm actually making enough headway there, but I'm, I, I'm gonna keep help, I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna keep trying. And maybe, I think she also likes, yeah, she does like purple mushrooms, so maybe we're gonna find some of those in the mines, maybe even gold quality, because that would be perfect. But yeah, um, at, until then, we're just gonna keep giving her the solar essence that we have, and I think that, I mean, it could be worse, uh, you know, in terms of that. And hopefully she's even gonna ask for more things on the notice board, which will also boost the friendship, so that would be awesome. But yeah, I think this is where I'm gonna leave it here. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited with how uh, everything has worked out and I hope you guys are too. Um, I can't wait for next episode. I think we have the, the dance coming up. Uh, I'm still gonna try to get the witch to four hearts but by then, but I don't think it's possible. But I don't really want to dance with anyone else and I don't think I can dance with Jody, which is unfortunate. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again, again in the next one. And until then, stay cozy, friends.